tested for free chlorine. Now we're going to go one step further and test for something we call combined chlorine. Once chlorine has done its job by killing a pathogen, a bacteria, something like that, body waste, it becomes combined chlorine. It has no disinfecting value. And when our combined chlorine gets up to about more than about 0.3 or 0.4 parts per million, we know we need to superchlorinate or oxidize that waste out. So with this exact sample, we will add, the, if we have three parts per million free, we will add five drops of reagent three. If the sample gets any darker red, we know we have the presence of combined chlorine. Give it a second or two, and it seems to be the same parts per million. So we've got three parts per million of free available chlorine and no combined chlorine. A perfect swimming atmosphere.